Do you wish to move to the UK to work someday on a skilled worker visa? Have you been searching for a job in the UK without any positive results? Do you wish to move to the UK with your family? Do you have dreams of moving abroad but you don't know where to start from? Probably because you have heard somehow that with your qualifications and skills there is no hope for you to get a job and move to the UK. That moving to the UK is just for a particular set of people. If you have answered yes to any of these questions I asked or maybe I didn't even touch on your circumstance but you know within you that you want to move to the UK I'm going to be helping you find a job so please stick with me to the end of this video so you get all the details and know that you don't have to be a doctor or a nurse or even a healthcare assistant to move to the UK you can move to the UK in your field you can move just as you are my name is Tochi you are welcome to my channel please give this video a thumbs up if you get value subscribe to my channel if you haven't share this video to everyone that benefit from it okay and to all my returning subscribers you guys are welcome back so i don't know what you must have heard about moving to the uk to work maybe you've been trying and you've not been getting any positive results or you've not been trying at all because you don't know where to start or how to go about getting a job in the uk whatever it is that is your situation we're going to be helping you find that dream job of yours in today's video i'm not just going to be giving you the fish in this video i'm going to be showing you how to find the fish so you can get exactly the size that you want i'll be sharing with you a secret that most people will not tell you i will show you how you can find a job how you can find these companies companies that are sponsoring you professionals are in demand people that are looking for you there are so many companies that are looking for you you just don't know them so i'm going to bring them to your doorstep right now i'm going to share my screen with you guys so you will see everything where we we'll dive right into it but first things first before you try getting a job in the uk there's something that you must do first of all you must identify and magnify your area of specialization what i mean by that is what is your skill what is your specialization what do you have experience in in what field have you got one year experience three years experience 15 years experience what can you really do like what are your strong points basically so you have to bring your best foot forward you have to understand what you're very good at what you offer because most companies will be looking at what exactly you bring to the table the uk job market is even more on your experience and skills not really about your qualifications so it's about what you can do what you can offer to the company that would hire you also you can look into related fields as well so you really don't have to box yourself exactly in your field you can also look beyond your field and look at what you can fit in as well so for instance you're a secretary you can look for administrative roles because you know that you can easily fit into that you're an accountant you can look for other financial roles other roles that you can actually fit in okay that way you're likely to have other options now after you've done that the next step is to go on all these professional job websites and begin to look for jobs in your field not only should you go on those websites and search for jobs from time to time you should also register upload your cv on those sites that way employers will be looking for you when there are jobs that suit your cv that suits your profile they will send you a last send you emails to notify you and ask you to apply so you can easily apply for those jobs in that instance all you have to do is just click on the apply button and apply now let me show you exactly how to do this remember that there are so many job websites in the uk i've made a detailed video on them i'll leave the link in the description box there are general websites where you can find jobs in different industries and there are specific websites websites that you can easily go to to search for teaching jobs to search for it jobs engineering jobs you know there are websites like that there is indeed read cv library glassdoor and the rest of them but for the purpose of this video i'm just going to take you guys to cv library one of the job websites and show you exactly what to do then you can always do that replicate this in other websites and look for these jobs so let's do cv library can you see this guys this is one of the job websites where you can easily get a job in the uk jobs in your field so this is it find a job that works for you so when you come here you will see jobs by industry jobs by location popular jobs jobs by company this is it 
185,463 new jobs added by 10,420 companies. So there are so many jobs for you here. These companies have added these jobs because they need you. So you just have to find these jobs and apply for them. Keywords, job title, job search, whatever. If you have any location in mind, you can type it in here and then you find the job. But for the purpose of this video, we're going to do a general search. And remember that if you're looking for jobs with visa sponsorship, always put that in your job search right so use that as a keyword if you're not looking for a job with sponsorship then don't worry about it so let's do engineering jobs with visa sponsorship let's put visa sponsorship in our search so this is what we're able to find from our search for engineering jobs is visa sponsorship so here you go electronics quality engineer this is the location is a permanent job you will see so many of them so all you have to do is just find a job in your field if you're an accountant accounting jobs with visa sponsorship if you're looking for sponsorship remember if you are a lawyer the same thing if you're a nurse exactly the same thing so you will get jobs like this you find something like this and then you can begin to search just make sure you verify that it has visa sponsorship before you apply especially if you're outside the uk because before you are able to move to the uk to work as a skilled worker you have to get a company that has license to sponsor you so you must always look for jobs with visa sponsorship see relocation benefits i think this one also has sponsorship so you can see they can actually help you relocate to the uk if they pick you okay just continue doing this from time to time make sure you put out as much applications as you can don't just apply for one or two jobs and say oh i've not been getting the jobs you must know how to go about it and be consistent with it we can also do indeed as well and see what he has you can upload your cv here like i mentioned earlier so once you upload your cv it'll be very very easy for you to be getting job notifications a lot and you know apply for jobs job title to keywords or company you're looking for you put it here the city you put it here then you find jobs just like that so we already have some here already head chefs so let's say we're looking for healthcare assistant jobs tier two sponsorship see healthcare home care assistant sponsorship available this is it guys so you see alternatively you can also do a general google search like where you go on google and type jobs in the uk with visa sponsorship or engineering jobs in the uk with visa sponsorship or something related let's try it out and see from the search you can even see some recommendations that okay something that people have typed in the past so jobs in the uk with you no know, experience jobs in the uk with visa sponsorship jobs in the uk for foreigners jobs in the uk for overseas applicants you know something around that so let's use this first one jobs in the uk with visa sponsorship right so let's just scroll through this page and see what we will find so 63 visa sponsorship jobs in the uk if you click on this you will definitely see something let's click on it and see what we can find so guys can you see 671 visa sponsorship jobs in the uk so if you go through it you'll definitely find something hgv mechanic visa sponsorship salary gp visa sponsorship can you see look at read here 659 visa sponsorship jobs this is uk hired you know so can you guys see this is exactly how to go about looking for a job in the uk visa sponsorship visa sponsorship so guys this is it don't forget that you can do all these things and do them so well and you won't get any positive results because you don't have a good cv so you must remember to draft write a professional cv a good cv to standard if you want to get a job or if you must stand a chance of getting a job to move to the uk because it's a competitive market you're not the only one searching for that job you're not the only one that needs visa sponsorship so these employers these recruitment agencies would always go for the best hands right the best man would always get the job if you look at those job adverts that they have put out in all these job websites and all you can easily just look at this person's specification look at you know the roles requirements and things like that and that that should guide you towards creating your own cv look out for their words their keywords their terms everything and tailor your cv to suit exactly what they are looking for another very important thing we shouldn't miss out is the fact that if you're searching for a job you don't always have to wait for these companies to put out their job vacancies in those job websites you can go to these companies yourself and find these jobs right so long as you know that these companies have 
have the license to sponsor you you know that they are eligible that they can actually give you or sponsor your visa to the uk then that's all that matters let me show you exactly how you can do that so this is tier two sponsors list basically all the companies that have license to sponsor your visa to the uk in different fields all the fields that you can think of you can also find this on the official uk government website at gov.uk but for the purpose of this video i like using this website because it's easier tier two sponsors list this is uk tier sponsors.co.uk so if you have a company in mind you can put it here the town industries and all and all industries so medical care home it computer administrative finance education advertising architecture arts call center civil engineering construction and all like see this one guys it was recently added it was added on the 23rd of october 2023 can you guys see and they keep updating these sites it's up to date so this is the industry wholesale and retail they were just added to this list recently this was also added in february 2023 okay let's just search one industry so you understand exactly what i'm saying better so let's say you want to go to uk as a teacher so let's do education and see you know companies in this field that have license to sponsor so let's search They're all here 012 global limited london education skilled worker just continue like that this is 11 plus teacher limited james ford education a rating skilled worker it was even added this year in april 2023 so it's like that just keep doing it this one was added in august 2023 first step child care limited as you have discovered that they are here they are on the tier 2 sponsors list so they are eligible to sponsor you to the uk all you have to do is now go on their websites right go on these individual company websites read up about them look out for vacancies jobs that are there at the moment or whenever you are applying apply to them right you might stand a chance of getting a job you never can tell if they love you if they love your cv if they're pleased with you they will reach out to you they will get back to you they'll stop an interview with you if you pass they'll give you your offer letter and then your cos with that you can now go ahead and apply for your visa with all the other necessary documents right so this is it exactly how to go about it there is no magic you just keep doing it like that if you don't want to go through the general company websites because there are a lot you can go and search for them by industries right so if you're in advertising you can do the same if you're in medical if you're looking for care homes you can do the same look at it care homes in the uk and then you can now begin to apply to these companies these ones just got their license as well abbey lodge care homes limited this is they just got it in august 2023 so i've had it for a long time Time, some just got theirs if you continue like that then you will definitely get something finally there is also what the uk calls the shortage occupation list so when you go online and look out for the uk shortage occupation list to discover whether your occupation is on that list if your occupation is in demand then there is also a chance that you might get a job and move to the uk but if your occupation is not on that list you can still move to the uk to work on a skilled worker visa the shortage occupation list just basically lowers the salary requirement visa application fees and all check with jobs are on the shortage occupation list in each area of the uk if your job is on the list you can be paid 80 percent of the job's usual going rate to qualify for a skilled worker visa right just go through it and you will definitely find something if your occupation is on the list that's good for you just go ahead and apply everything you have learned in today's video and start looking for companies that can sponsor you to the uk give you a job give you your cos and you know let you move to the uk and if your occupation is not on the list as well you can also put all these things we have learned into practice and you will find something hopefully okay so this is the shortage occupation list as it is is everything they're all here so just go through this list just as you have seen here hopefully you would find something so guys this is it for today's video i hope it helps thank you all so much for watching i wish you guys all the best and i will see you in my next one Bye bye